In this big tractor power video, we're going to spend some time out in some Illinois fields with an Alice Chalmers 8550 four-wheel drive tractor. This machine is rated at 305 engine horsepower and was produced from 1978 through 1981. Initially, when Alice Chalmers introduced this tractor on the market in 1978, it was marketed as the Super Beast because of its large size, its twin mufflers that resemble the ocean liner, the Queen Mary, and its turbocharged 731 cubic inch engine, which is capable of unleashing a lot of horsepower out in the field, pulling heavy duty tillage implements and working a lot of ground in the day. In this video, we'll spend time out in the field so that you can see and hear this big machine at work, as well as climbing up in the cab to see the operator's perspective and talking about its overall specifications. So let's head out to the field and see this big prairie monster go to work. Now that we've spent some time down on the ground watching this big tractor, let's climb up in the cab and see what it's like to be behind the wheel of this twin stack monster. The Alice Chalmers Acoustic Cab 2 is fitted with a modern right-hand console which gives the operator easy access to the power director transmission and all the hydraulic remote levers that control the implement being pulled by this tractor. It has 41 square feet of tinted tempered glass which gives a panoramic view of the field. As the tractor moves forward the operator has a clear view of the work ahead. This is a pretty modern tractor for the late 1970s and it has a nice cab layout for 
farmers looking to cover big acres. We can see the panoramic view from behind the tractor and we can see that Alice Chalmers 2500 tandem disc working up ground behind the machine. Let's step outside the cab. We can see that it has the optional stadium lighting package which has 12 lights fitted all the way around the cab of the tractor and on the rear fenders. It also has two electronic mirrors so with a flip of a switch the operator can see the work being done behind this big four-wheel drive tractor. We can see it has the Alice Chalmers luxury seat and it is fitted with orange fabric right along the operator's back to help them stay cool in the summer and warm in the winter. The tractor also has a telestopping steering wheel for easy control of the direction of this big machine. Now let's sit back and see the operator's perspective of running this big Alice Chalmers. One thing I rarely get to do is actually drive the tractors I'm filming. I'm too busy doing all the camera work, but on this day I got to get behind the wheel of the Alice Chalmers Super Beast. It's really easy to operate. Again, that right hand console has all the controls with the transmission and the hydraulic remotes and really you just control everything through your throttle, throttle up to move across the field and throttle down to turn around. Let's talk about the specifications of the Alice Chalmers 8550 four-wheel drive tractor. This machine is rated at 305 engine horsepower and 253 PTO horsepower and features a fully independent 1000 RPM power takeoff. It's powered by an Alice Chalmers 6120T 731 cubic inch engine featuring dual turbochargers and four valves per cylinder. It has a 20-speed shift-on-the-go transmission. It's a power director partial power shift with 20 forward and 4 reverse speeds. The fuel tank holds 170 gallons of diesel fuel. The tractor's factory weight is 26,400 pounds. It was produced from 1978 through 1981 at Alice Chalmers West Alice, Wisconsin Tractor Factory. The original price tag of an 8550 was $83,753. It was tested in the fall of 1978 at the University of Nebraska under test number 1262 to certify all of its specifications. I hope you've enjoyed this video featuring the Alice Chalmers 8550 Super Beast tractor. There's actually been two different 8550 tractors featured in the video. The first one is the one you're watching now. It's pulling an Alice Chalmers 2600 heavy duty disc. This disc has a unique history all to itself. It is actually the disc that was featured in the tillage demonstrations in the 1983 Farm Progress Show. The disc and the 8550 continue to work on a farm in the Champaign-Urbana, Illinois area. The second model is the one that we spent time up in the cab that was pulling the 2500 Alice Chalmers disc and that machine works in southeastern Illinois in the Willow Hill area. I hope that you've enjoyed this video and will consider subscribing to Big Tractor Power YouTube where there are over 1,000 videos of farm machines in action. If you have any questions or thoughts, please leave them in the comments section area as I try to respond to every post that is made. If you'd like to get a preview of what is coming up on Big Tractor Power YouTube next, make sure to check out Big Tractor Power Instagram where I share pictures and short video clips of what is currently being filmed in the field. As always, thank you for watching.